Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Um, currently, I am sitting in a new project car. Yes, another project car. Um, I am... I acquired this vehicle yesterday, but it's been in the works for a while. Like, a very, a very long time. Um, I am excited for this project car. Hopefully you guys will be excited. This one actually runs and drives better than the Accord. The Accord doesn't even start at all. So, let me tell you guys how I, I acquired this vehicle first. So, if you guys haven't been staying up to date on the videos, um, in the video where I got the Z, the Nismo Z wheels for the TL, I mentioned that I had a set of wheels that were my dream wheels and I always wanted to put on a car. Um, so those wheels are actually gone. So that's how I acquired the Civic. Those wheels were work equipped 05s. I'm gonna post a picture of it right here. Um, they're 18 by 12 and 18 by 13. Uh, got it for 400 bucks off of Facebook Marketplace. Had maybe 8,000 layers of spray paint on them, which wasn't really too bad. You can get them sandblasted or, you know, send them off or whatever. Um, but I just didn't want to do that at the time. I had the wheels for about a year or so, um, and I just haven't touched them at all. I took a wire wheel to one of the barrels yes i took a wire wheel to it um just to see if the paint would come off came off easily um the bolts are it was a 40 bolt um face and barrel and lip or whatever yada yada um my buddy that i traded um actually took them apart and he noticed that one of the wheels had jb weld all over the boats bolts sorry and he had a hard time getting that one apart. Personally, I'd rather get a new project for the channel than put another set of wheels on the TL because I know how many videos you guys see of me putting wheels on the TL. So I wanted to introduce a new car to the channel and I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what it is right now. Here she is. This is my 19, oh no, this is my 2000 Honda Civic um, HX Coupe. Uh, yes, it's not in the best of shape. It's got a dent on the bumper right there, missing the side skirt. Uh, cut rear bumper. It's got the 50-50s. Um, this car did come with a lot of goodies, as you can tell by the intro of the video of what I was sitting on. A nice Sparco racing seat. This is probably my first ever bucket seat that's actually name brand. I never had a bucket seat before. So let me go ahead and show you the interior. So the Civic does have full interior, um, which is perfect what I wanted. I really wanted a four door version EK. Always been searching for one, but I came across this two door from my buddy and we made a deal um it is a hx so it's a d16y5 has 272 on the dash it is five speed you can see first second third fourth fifth and then straight back is reverse um ouch a fucking zip tie right there anyways um car is pretty nice interior the radio does work um drove it home tested out that radio um so d16 y5 this car did come with a lot of goodies uh one being this nice seat in here brand new nrg floor mats um but i'll go over in the next video of exactly what this car came with uh everything does work except for ac there's no hard lines for the ac so this will be my new daily vehicle. Um, kind of, you know, drive to work and back. It saves a lot of gas because it's a Y5. Um, pretty much it on the interior. Oh, 
it is converted from power window i mean manual windows to power windows so you can see that automatic locks on both doors um so let me go ahead and explain exactly what the deal was when i traded so my buddy had this car for maybe a year or so so around the same time i got the wheels he had this car he traded a gs for gs 300 running and driving uh for this car was running and driving had ac it was completely stock came from an auction um so basically the trade was for the the work equips ofis plus a thousand dollars for this civic and i'm quite happy with it because i actually owned a 1996 honda civic hx two-door coupe um as my first vehicle it had about maybe 300 to 400 dollars 300 to 400 thousand miles on it roughly it was black um had the 96 front end of course didn't have the facelift always wanted the facelift one of my dream cars is actually a em1 ek but this will suffice um don't worry to will still always be in the videos um the cord i know i'm sorry i just got this accord um for free actually but this accord is going to the salvage yard i know you guys wanted to see videos on it i really wanted to do a vip build on this accord but with the roof being damaged and the car not starting it doesn't even turn over of course because it basically needs everything brand new roof is worth more than the accord under the engine bay i showed you guys last video this whole bunch of leaves looks like a rat nest in there actually one of the ignition cables was cut looks like a rat chewed it up um but this accord is sadly going to the scrap yard and you can't really see it now it was a clean body except for the roof but now this is our new project for the channel um i have lots of things planned for this car possibly b20 maybe k24 um but right now it's going to be a daily yes the bumper's hanging yes i got steelies on here um i do need to buy some tires for this car before i start dailying it needs some brakes i believe it needs some motor mounts um when i got the car the hood latch was working properly now it is stuck closed um but yeah this is the new ek probably gonna get it cleaned up uh maybe a little bit later today or when i set up the pressure washer get it washed up a little bit make it look a little bit nicer but for now the new project car old project car going to scrapyard car that's just going to sit there for family travels and then the weekend car yes i could make this the daily again like revert it back to stock and then make that the full-blown race car but i actually love the tl more than i do the civic anyways guys uh let me know what you guys think about the new project car it is lowered um like i said the next video is going to go over exactly what came with this deal with the car because it did come with a lot of goodies that some i do like and some i don't like um but whatever i wanted a new project car also wanted another old civic so here she is let me know what you guys think down below also leave any suggestions i should do to the civic um or like what color i should paint it i don't know i don't know if i should leave it red because i already have the tl that's red but the tl is shitly wrapped most likely gonna redo that in another video as well the cord i just did not want to keep sitting here on the tire where it's all moldy it does have the full blown blue interior it is a five speed but i that was just so much work like that's way too this car is worth nothing really so it's going to the scrapyard you will probably see it at your local pull apart um but yeah let me know what you guys think down below in the comments 
please like, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for the new videos. Peace.